Hello everyone, it's Taylor Day and I have a really weird, disgusting story to share and I've been wanting to tell people, so here I am making a video about it. So this past week, I was mowing my lawn in like, a picture or whatever, it was mid on Sunday and it was like 96 degrees and it was like humid and the sun was beating down and it was just terribly hot miserable when I was mowing the lawn and my lawn is on hill so I'm like up and down the hill and it was just terrible the whole thing was just terrible and it was bad from the beginning and this is just straight karma so you want to know what this it was karma but okay so I'm mowing the lawn and it's karma because when we mow the lawn so there's like these ant piles in our yard and so we decided that we like to mow over it me and my dad being we and so we mow over these ant piles and like these ants come like squirming out like oh my god I'm getting eaten alive and then after we mow over them we pour a bunch of poison on them to kill them because we don't want them here near our house but the ants have gotten smart and so they're like oh you kill me over here by the road and they move in closer to the house and we're like no so now we're having to kill more ant piles and put more poison down to convince them that they need to go back towards the road it's pretty disgusting it's, it's pretty disgusting the whole thing and so like I call them my little you know what that's my army. That's the army. That's the little ants. The ants are the army. You know why I'm saying this. It was a straight karma for doing this. See, so that was my law. We've been doing this for a while. We've been over it and we put poison down. And so, I guess the ants have a way of talking, telepathically moving their antlers, whatever, antennas, to talk to other bugs. And they must have, like, complained about it or set up a mission. To attack me. So you know when you're mowing there's like bugs that bother you like gnats get up in your face and they're like buzzing near your eyes and your ears and you're just like swatting them away as you like mowing like don't wait me bug. And so that's usually what happens. Well this particular day there's a lot more gnats than usual and they were just like all over the place and I was like okay wow what, what, where's all these gnats from? And so I'm like fly up I'm flying. No, so they like fly around me and I'm like mowing the lawn and I'm running over these ant piles and putting poison down. And, and they also telepathically described, like, they must have been like, we're gonna attack. We need air power, and you're my air power. So, like, the army, the, the army, the, the air, the air force nap. That's what I call the air force nap. And so, and they were flying around, and they were like, okay, it's time to, like, go in for the attack. And I had a bunch of gnats around me and I was like pushing them away. There's like five of them on my face. And I was like, get away from me. And I was, I was like, get away from me. I was like pushing the lawn mower. And the next thing you know, a gnat went up my nose. It went up my nose. And I was like, oh my god, no. And I was like, I stopped the lawn mower and I was trying to like blow it out. And I want to come out. And I kept blowing my nose as much as I possibly could and it just would not come out. And so I like was like pinching really tight, also trying to kill it, because I'm like, oh, either it's dead in my nose, did I have it like squirming in there? I don't know. And so I'm like trying to blow it out of my nose as far as I possibly can and nothing's happening. And so I finally run inside and I just blow my nose and and it finally came out because I like looked and you see this little black gnat in like snot and I was like, are you kidding me? right now this is absolutely disgustingly like I, I don't know it was just absolutely disgusting and I hated it and I was like you've got to be kidding this was straight karma for killing the ants and this is why you shouldn't kill ants but I do I still did and I was like you know what screw you ants and I went right back outside I kept mowing and I mowed over several more ant piles and after I had done mowing I was hot and sweaty I was like ready to go in and my dad asked me because he had been trimming the uh, hedges they go around and pick up all the leaves I had like leaves and branches I cut off and so I was like okay whatever I'll go do that so I went and was like, picking them up and another gnat flew into my eyeball and once I finally got it out I like lost my contact in the process so I was like are you freaking kidding me and it, it's karma I ran over ant piles and put poison on them and killed baby ants and they decided to attack me so I guess this is what you get when you kill other bugs other bugs attack for them and that's what happened to me and I felt like I needed to share that because I felt like gnats flying up your nose isn't a normal thing to happen so I was talking to a couple of my friends and I told them and they all laughed at me and so that's just really disgusting and weird and then one of my friends was like oh that has to be all done and I'm all like what? <laughs> Bugs flying up your nose all the time? <laughs> he goes yeah I'm mowing the lawn or mowing my school like 
baseball field because he like mows his old high school baseball field. I don't know why, but he does. I guess he gets paid for it. And he like mows it, and he's like, yeah, they just blow it when it was a little dying. I'm like, that's so disgusting. Like, that is not normal. Like everyone I talk to says they don't get bugged. I don't know. Maybe you guys do. Maybe like just leave in the comments, like to say like, yeah, I get bugs at my nose when I mow. I don't know. Like to me, that's not normal. That's that's never happened before, and I think it's absolutely disgusting. I think it's the weirdest story, and I share it with everyone because I'm like, if you want to hear a disgusting story? A bug flew at my nose, and so. I don't know. Maybe it does happen often, and y'all can tell me if it does, and maybe it doesn't happen that often, but I don't think it does. So, I just wanted to share that story because it was just the most disgusting and weirdest story that has ever happened to me, and that was it. So, yeah, there's going to be more videos to come outside of this one. It's my first real video, so bye guys. Have a nice day. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you want to hear more weird, disgusting videos about it, subscribe to my page. Taylor Day, you should do it because there's gonna be a lot of interesting videos coming up soon, and better lighting because it's kind of terrible in here. What can you do? Work with, work with what you get, right? <laughs> yeah. So, bye. Like, subscribe, Taylor Day. Bye, everyone.